Oh uh, boy. Why am I doing this? Why? Hey guys, Ranger here, and I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, I decided for the heck of it, I would do... <laughs> I would do this video, um, being that my channel is now, I mean, is just, is a little ways from 27,000 subscribers, which, by the way, thank you all so much for. Um, I decided for the heck of it, since I've got a little bit of comments like this, I decided for the heck of it to do a video reading some of the negative and the weird comments that I have received. Now, some of these, you know, are obviously are the insulting comments directed at me at, directed at me as an insult. Some of these are just kind of weird, which you will see. So, without further ado, let's begin on some of these and read some of these videos, shall we? This guy says, Fuiva. Okay. Good to know. Thank you very much. Insidious Meme says, okay, let me get this straight. Grown man, a effing kid show for four-year-old girls. Crying. Is this what humanity has come to? Not hating, but why are you into this? Well, because I am. Okay, let's analyze this for a second. An effing kid show. Right. So, do you also think Spongebob is an effing kid show too, huh? A show for four-year-old girls. So you know the direct demographic of the show. So I'm also assuming, it, by your logic, grown men and women should not be walking around with Spongebob t-shirts, correct? Uh-huh. You're global that. Sanness says, kill yourself. Uh-huh. Right. Nah. Ray Nightmare says, is it just me or his laughs are so fake how he goes to villain laugh to... Is it just me or his laughs are so fake how he goes to villain laugh to... Right, okay. Shouldn't it be, is it just me, or is his laughs? Yeah. Kind of kind of difficult for me to take you seriously. Whenever you don't capitalize any of your letters or put any sort of punctuation there. Kind of hard for me to kind of take you seriously on that one. But, yeah, another one of those fake laugh things. Yes, a villain laugh. <laughs> yeah, that's my villain laugh. Yeah, as you can tell, that's a fake laugh. Anna Jimenez says 700, 750, and 8. Okay, honestly, this is a spam thing because I clicked onto those, their timestamps for the for those videos of mine. I didn't see any sort of significance for what they were trying to point out to. If you want to put a timestamp in a video, please point out what the timestamp is supposed to be. Don't just put numbers. This, it's not, it's not a good idea. Not a good idea. Polyrath Gaming says, This just supports the fact that bronies are mental. This guy has ADHD and won't shut the F up. Also, gay brony, you failed humanity. Uh-huh. This just supports the fact that bronies are mental. This guy has ADHD. I don't know if I have ADHD. I've never been tested for it. Won't shut the F up. Then you really don't want to go to one of my family reunions, pal. You really don't want to. Also, you'd probably hate to work with me, wouldn't you? Like, you'd probably jump off the roof of the building. Supports the fact that, yeah, whenever you say that, you're including everybody. Yet here is this guy accusing me of being mental, all bronies in general. Says I have ADHD and won't shut the F up, and says I failed humanity. And he says, and he thinks he's making a point? Yeah, he did. He just made a point that he's judgmental. Gay brony, you failed humanity. Polyrath Gaming, you failed at commenting. Tenzin Jigdal. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If that's a real name, I'm sorry. Um, but Jigdal. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> you don't know about cars, idiot. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's funny. The guy that commented on this was in a reference to, my, uh, to one of my videos pertaining to Initial D. No, I don't know 
very I don't I know very little about foreign cars, about the engine specs, uh, transmissions, uh, anything like that about foreign cars because I was not born and raised in a foreign country. I was born and raised where there are North American cars, so I know more about them than I do foreign cars. So yeah, but. I'm always trying to learn new things about cars, both uh, both cars of my, you know, of of my birth birth country, um, and other countries too. I have an interest in all cars from different countries, and also, and but I'll be the first to tell you, I don't. I mean, I will not profess that I know a lot about cars, even North American cars. I don't. I'm not the kind of person to say I know a lot about this or that. So. I, I would say I don't know anything, but you don't know crap about cars, idiot. Right. Well, sorry if I don't know everything about cars that I'm supposed to, but yeah, you didn't type out anything in the comment there about anything that I was supposed to know, so kind of doesn't say you know anything either, buddy. Patty Torres says, what WTF did I just watch? You ruined my childhood. That was actually in regard to the Shed 17 video. Ma'am, I'm assuming, yeah, ma'am, um, Miss Torres, if that, if you've managed to make it that long before you had your childhood ruined, you done good. You done good. But here's a fact. If you're on the internet, prepare to have your childhood ruined. Like, if you don't want your childhood ruined, get rid of your computer, stay off any social media, get a basic flip phone that doesn't have any sort of internet connection, you're good. You're totally good. Lava Kid says, really, you effing beep, a beep, f beep, you, why just beeping kill yourself? You know, if I had one of those actual bleeping things, I'm pretty sure I would summon... I'm pretty sure there would be a ship that would float up the road to my house because it would think I was sending Morse code due to the beeps. And this was on... <laughs> this, this comment is just, like, trying to insult me, calling me every name in the book, pretty much, without even saying what I did wrong! Or without even saying anything! Kill your, except for, kill yourself. Nah, don't want to. I'll pass, thanks. And... No thanks on the offer. But again, this just... And the guy didn't even spell it right. Like, the guy didn't even spell right. He didn't even spell that right. And again, n n no pop periods, no commas, nothing. Love a kid. Kid! Kid! Yeah, I... Total, like, any respect that I might have had for this guy just went out the window whenever I just now saw the name. Like, I just had this image of some little kid doing this. Real tough, buddy. Real tough. Say that to your boss next time he gets on to you for something. Yeah. You'll have a lot of time to make friends at the unemployment office. Christopher Araga says, Yeah, sure, buddy. More like you're a queer. In regard to me checking out one, one of the Mickey Mouse cartoons. Yeah, so if checking out a Mickey cartoon makes you a queer, then I'm proud to be one. And so is many other people in the United States. My gosh, what do you do when they're... I'm assuming you can't go to Disney World or Disneyland because you would have a 404 error. You'd be walking around queer, 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 and you, you would short circuit. Like, your brain would just explode. So, yeah. So, okay, okay. Again, I'm wielding the other side of this double-edged sword here. So what do you think about people that like Looney Tunes, Bugs Bunny? What about people that like Garfield? Right? What What about them? How can they be in the right? But people that like Disney is in the wrong. Kind of a biased statement there, don't you think? Blake Goff says, You can tell when they're fake reactions when they last so quick. Right. They, when they're... You didn't put the right word. When they laugh when they laugh. So, obviously you've watched other reactors, and that's what you think as well, because you didn't exactly put when he laughs so quick. So, apparently it's just me. I mean, so apparently it's not just me. So, yeah, has anybody got a comment from this guy? Blake Goff saying, you know, the same thing, copy and paste. 
again, it's another comment in regard to my laughter. I do laugh quick in real life. People that know me know how quickly I laugh. It's another one of those things where people accuse me of having fake laughter. Um, again, about being totally fake. Uh, I just wonder how many other reactors' videos this guy has went to and topped out that same comment. Yeah, have a lot, a lot of time on his hands. Gene Tear <clears throat> says, Your reaction is like poker face. <clears throat> Um, yeah. Okay, first off, I think you have a Luna emblem as your avatar, so kudos on that one. But, yeah, I'm not sure if you're meaning that as an insult or not. I really don't know. But, yeah, some videos I can react to different, different videos are different, obviously. Some videos you're going to react to more things that happen. Other videos you're just staring at it, analyzing it, taking it all in. And the video in question is, pardon me, and the video for in question for that is Lullaby for a Princess. So, yeah, a lot of people, I know, sat there just stoic, just taking in everything, just listening to the singing, gazing at the animation. So, yeah, there were a lot of us that sat there with Poker Face. Zach Whitbecker. <laughs> Sorry. Um, it's an anime avatar, but not really sure what it is from, though. My Little Pony is an effing dumb show where ponies suck other ponies' dicks. F your chan, your chanlet. Buddy, I really don't think we're watching the same show, because that's not the show I know. Where ponies suck each... Yeah, again, I have to wonder, what is this... Like, does this guy ignore every animation, every cartoon that exists, because everything's the same to him? F your channel -a. Dude, you can't even spell right. Like, yeah, I know spell check is definitely a problem, but whenever you're using your phone... But, I mean, hey, if you have spell check automatically turned on to find the words... It's not hard to see them whenever you have that little red line underneath them. It's an effing dumb show. How many, You know, I'm just wondering how many people have looked at this guy and said his shows that he watches are dumb. Maybe he's channeling that aggression into a comment. I'm no therapist. Joseph Fagan. <laughs> I'm sorry, are these real names? Like, seriously, are these real names? Um... Mark my words, you and the furries will be wiped of the face of the planet. Shouldn't it be off, pal? Right. What is that avatar even? Anyway. So, you have a problem with furries. And bronies. Right. But you do not have a problem with game fans, like video game fans or different fandoms. So what happens if you walked into a Star Trek convention? Would you have a seizure? Left off the face of the planet. Yeah, not going to happen, pal. Pretty sure we're still going to be around after you're dead. And even if all of us were wiped from existence tomorrow, would you be happy? No. You would. There would still be moments in your life whenever you would find something to criticize. So, yeah, it doesn't really help anything, does it, if you're still going to be miserable? Shall... I think, is that Undertale? I don't know. You mumbled and nodded your head this entire big video. Tell me again how this gets 94 effing thousand views. Utter crap. Uh-huh. And also, stop doing reaction videos. Really, please. It's cancer. You're contributing to cancer. Yeah. Uh, first off, the first one. Mumbled and nodded your head. Mumbled. Uh-huh. Right. Nod in my head. Yeah, that's because I like the music. I typically nod my head, tap my foot, or move my fingers whenever I hear music that I like. The entire beep video. Tell me again how this gets 94 effing thousand. I don't know, buddy. I didn't... I don't know. Utter crap. Then why are you here? Like, seriously, why are you here? If you don't like it, 
to watch. Simple. Stop doing reaction videos. Really, please. It's cancer. You're contributing to cancer. You're right. Again, why are you here? If you don't like it, don't watch. Simple as that. So, if I stopped doing reactions completely and still and just did traditional reviews, would you be okay with that? Like, would you come back to the channel? Or would you still stay away? Again, this one I was saying is, if you don't like, buddy, just walk away. Like, nobody's making you. Nobody had, nobody is forcing you. Nobody's holding your head at the screen making you watch. If you don't like it, don't watch. Simple as that. It's not hard to do. My Fuji. My Fuji. My Fu. I don't know. I'm sorry. I probably read that wrong. Actually, considering this guy's comment, I really don't care. Whoa, look. A crippled autistic adult. Uh-huh. Well, look, a judgmental comment. Ha. Huh. I think this guy obviously thinks he's trying to be cool by saying, whoa, look, a crippled... It's... He kind of makes it sound like it, it's a Pokemon game. Like, oh, look. Oh, look, a crippled autistic adult. Right. Is that what you do in real life? Like, you're just walking down the street, driving. Oh, look, an autistic adult. Right. Again, good luck telling that to your boss. Like, good luck telling that to your boss. We'll see what happens. TV 10 videos T TV 10 videos TYT What is even that in the the avatar man what is even that Whoops says crap hold on my thingy went the way there we go F you may I don't know I just had sex you ever Right Good to know. Thanks for sharing. Did not need to know. A little too much information there. Okay, seriously, the, fun, the funny thing was, whenever I went to... I actually went to this person's YouTube channel before, uh, after they put this comment, and <laughs> this was like a little bitty kid. This was like like eight-year-old boy or something like that? Ten-year-old boy? And I'm just like... I, like, whenever I saw it, I saw it, I'm just like... And then I started laughing. Uh, he spells mate with an M and an eight like that makes him look cool and says IDK I don't know what does he not know and then puts in all caps I just had sex yeah um did you tell your mom that too your dad like did you tell your teacher your uncle your grandparents your aunt like did is that really something you want to brag to everybody do you want to get like a bullhorn and stand on top of the Stand on top of town of City Hall and shout it out to the world. I don't know of anybody that's done that, so yeah, you might be the first, so congrats on that. Roblox player says, I used to be subbed since maybe five thousand subs, but I got unsubbed a long time eggy. <laughs> okay. First off, I don't even know what this avatar is. I know it's supposed to be some dude's mouth turned upside down with eyes edited on the chin. I know that. Roblox, Roblox player. Okay, whatever. And th okay, again, I think it's funny, honestly, about these comments. I used to be subs, and but I got unsubbed. I think it's hilarious whenever these people, like I've seen other other people on other YouTubers that I am that I that I am subscribed to say I unsubbed, but usually it's funny that they usually did it. I think like they commented right after they did. This is kind of like the YouTube comment section equivalent of, of a breakup. Saying, I'm breaking up with you. It's over. I'm leaving. And I'm taking this with me. This is pretty much what this is. My response to this is, okay, bye. Like, seriously. Uh, you unsubbed. Okay, cool. I don't ask people to sub. To I've never once asked people to subscribe. I've never had anything in my videos... Telling people, please subscribe. Or even tell people to like a video. Um, it's people's choice. Like, if you want to like a video, if you want to, um, if you, pardon me, if you want to like a video, if you want to subscribe, that's cool, fine, thank you. I, I, I really, really appreciate it. Um, and again, if you want to unsubscribe, again, I'm not going to beg you to stay. It's your choice. I mean, you're completely free to make that choice. And I'm not going to control you. I, I don't want to try to control you. I don't want... You, I don't want to force anybody to stay if if they don't want to. It's completely your choice. Um, but again, I find this hilarious that this guy just has to tell you. Like, this just, just has to get it out of his system that he unsubbed. Okay? 
I don't recall ever seeing this guy comment, so I'm certainly not going to miss him. What was his name again? Kairos Jama says, this isn't reacting. This is slightly moving your head to a beat. I'm glad that you know the very de definition of what a reaction is. You need to be writing the dictionaries because obviously you know the real meaning of what something is. Am I right? So obviously I'm supposed to be like, ooh, ah, oh, wow, whoa, through the whole thing, right? <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that. Sorry, forgive me, everybody. Um, <laughs> forgive me for that. I'm not. I'm not high. Believe. I'm. I, I, I'm seriously not. I'm not. Don't worry. Um, I am insane. Yes, but yeah, I'm not off my. Okay, I'm off my rocker. But you know what I mean. But yeah, this is slightly moving your head to the beat. Again, I have to say this is something else. Again, if you don't like. You could have been watching another video in the time that it took you to type out that comment. Even if you're... Again, that's just a couple of seconds right there that you could have already clicked onto another video and had it loading. As opposed to... Beep! Send. Addis... Vigelis... Or... Vigelis... Or... Vig... Something... Says... I don't know what this says. Either... I'm a little concerned here. Either... ET got a new service plan. Either ET got a new service plan and is trying to comment on videos on YouTube, or somebody, or somebody just had a seizure on their keyboard, or somebody's hamster just tap danced across the keyboard. I don't know. I really don't know. Maybe we should. Should I call 911 for this person? It's been a while back, so they're probably dead. Unless their hamster is still tap dancing. Their hamster might still be tap dancing across keyboards. They might have moved on to Broadway. The tap dancing keyboard warriors. Or the tap dancing... I don't know. Somebody can come up with a better name, I'm sure. Little Ropo W says 1043. Okay, okay. That is a cute avatar, I have to say. That's a cute little avatar. But again, I ask this person... Could you please explain why you posted a timestamp and nothing else? They never replied! How can I take you seriously whenever you post a timestamp, but they never reply? Again, I could not see anything significant about this particular timestamp. So again, if you're going to put a timestamp for something, please at least have the decency to post what it's supposed to be a timestamp for. Please. Chantel Robinson says, Music means awesome. Employer, ask you something. Also, after 810, after 8 download, for free now in Kennesaw and... What? Uh, okay. What? I'm sorry? What? Download Kennesaw. Where the freak is Kennesaw? Kennesaw State University. Where is it? Oh, it's in Georgia. Okay. Uh, what? Kennesaw State Athletics. Kennesaw State University. What? I'm sorry, what? After 8, download free now. Can why, do I, why would I need to go all the way to Kennesaw just to download something? And what? I think this person had... I think this person finally... I think their seizure ended. And that, that was it. Rest, rest in peace, Chantel. Rest in peace, buddy. Maybe. Unless you got blown up and then you're resting in pieces. K-Pops says, don't subscribe that. Overacting reaction. I know he know the statement. Overacting re cryon so plastic. Okay, the one thing I have to say, I like the avatar. It's from an a it's from an anime, I assume. Does anybody know the anime? K pops. I like K pop too. But this guy kind of insults it. Don't subscribe to that. Don't you mean don't subscribe to that? And again, you're telling people you're kind of being controlling telling people what they can and cannot subscribe to. If you don't like something, cool, fine. But you don't it, you should not be telling somebody, hey, don't subscribe to that because I don't like it. It's kind of selfish. Overacting reaction, I know he know the statement. What statement? I know he know. I, what? What? What statement? And I know he know. I'm sorry, what? Overacting, recry on, so plastic. 
Right, because reactions are plastic now. <clears throat> I'm having a hard time taking that seriously whenever I reading whenever I reading you comments. That's how I feel right now. Um <laughs> uh, Okay. I want you inside of me, Oni Chan. My name says it all. I don't need to say anything more. The F is this obese man child's channel. Right. Man childs. You know, again, I can't take somebody seriously whenever they have that as their username. And that is their avatar. I can't. How can I take you seriously if you're not trying to be serious? And if you, Maybe you're trying to be ironic, but again, it doesn't work. Like, whenever you're trying to be serious, you can't be ironic at the same time. It just, does, it just doesn't work. It doesn't work. Again, you ask that question. Obviously, you never figured out the answer. I still don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess we'll both never know. But again, hey, if you don't like, don't watch Simple as that. Don't bother me none. Piggy Dojo 3090. Is that a cat avatar? I don't think you like watching this stupid MLP beep. No, I don't like watching stupid MLP beep. I like watching good MLP beep. Uh, I think it's funny. This guy has really no idea. If he goes through some of my videos, he'll see me wearing uh, wearing a pony shirt. He'll see, yes, I'm a brony. If he would click onto some of my links to my DeviantArt, to my fanfiction, to my fanfiction, to Facebook, to Twitter, he would see I'm a brony. Why would I force myself behind enemy lines for so long if I had no interest in something? Right. What? Uh, again. Yeah. If you think it's crap, cool. Okay, cool. Don't care. Um. You know what? Again, that's fine. Uh, I respect your opinion, but you know I like it. So, okay. Andrew Horta Fomer. So I would love to be the cop that pulls this guy over and reads his license. Andrew Fomer. <laughs> a bunch of bullshit. Uh, okay, thank you for sharing your opinion. Uh, here is my click. <laughs> okay, that, okay. Now, there's some other comments here, which I will read. <laughs> here are some other comments. <clears throat> Yeet, Yeet Filet. <clears throat> says, you be looking like a duck. To which I graciously responded, quack. So I guess we're all ducks here. Quack. SG Prail Fan says, dude, you're not even reacting. You're just staring at it. What is the point of this video? What the beep? And, okay, I like the train avatar. I like that. That's the only thing I give you credit for. I don't know what the name represents, though. Dude, you're not even reacting. You're just staring at it. What is the point of the video? What's the point of your comment? You don't like something. You didn't have to make a comment, but you did. Why? What's the point of doing that? So I guess we're both asking questions we're never going to know the answer to now, aren't we? Again, so I again, everybody has different reactions to different things. You can put ten people in a room and have the, all ten react to, to one particular thing, and they're all going to have a different reaction. That's just the way it is. Your brain says... Burn. You need to burn. Right. I'm assuming he's saying I need to burn a neck. Right. Okay. Uh, but he has... Is that Team Fortress Avatar? I mean, I like Team Fortress. But, yeah. In your brain. Why is that even your username? What does it mean? My brain would not be telling me that. My brain... Is weird, but it would not be telling me that. You're not my brain, dude. You're not my brain. 2KB says, you got no... You look like the inside of other Peplos a holio. You know, dude, it really is not a good idea to drink and type. Like, do not type while drinking. Or, it's, it doesn't work. Not a good idea. Not a good idea. With this guy, and he has an NBA thing. 
Okay, I know some people like basketball, but I'm not a fan. With this guy topping like this, how can anybody take him seriously? And again, the topper of all of the weird comments that I have received, this is by far the weirdest comment that I have received. So, so This is by far the weirdest comment and the most nonsensical, out-of-place comment that I have ever received. This comment was posted on, but because of the context of it, it was hidden by the filters, and I had to approve it before it would become visible. This was posted on my model kit video where I restored that Virginia State Police 78 Monaco. This is a comment that this person posted. J.B. Smith posts this. And this is the comment. Uh, I'm just going to show the different sections of the comment so that you can uh, go over it yourself. The funny thing is, this comment ultimately says, um, at the end, most of all, beware of state and local police in Virginia, etc. Okay, this is by far the weirdest and most nonsensical comment that I have ever received. This was a political, this was a statement that this person tried to make on a comment in a comment section pertaining to a model kit. That was so far out there, I think this person hit their head on Jupiter. That's the equivalent of walking into a funeral home and yelling, BANANAS! It makes just as much sense. This was a model kit video that I did of me, I mean this was a video of me working on restoring a model kit. I was not trying to make any sort of statement, make any, I mean, make any sort of, create or start any sort of movement. I just wanted to work on a model kit. And this person goes on this big, long rant, posting this big thing, this big wall of text, on a video that it had no point in being on. It wasn't a video where people were talking about said issue, if, if that's an issue. It was just a model kit video, again. And, okay, I went to this person's uh, Google Plus page. They had posted the same, they had copy and pasted the exact same comment on many other videos. Not mine. No other model kit videos, but it was other videos pertaining to, like, uh, things pertaining to state police, uh, police in general, etc. This person had co had posted the same comment on many of these other videos. How the freaking heck they found my model kit video, I don't know. And why they were so empowered to post that on a model kit video. It makes no dang sense. This is by far the weirdest comment that I've ever received on any video at all. This one is the topper right here, guys. This is the topper for the weirdest comment that I have ever received, ever. I don't think anything can top this. I really don't. And please don't anybody try, okay? Please don't try. But anyway, yeah, it's weird. I don't get it. Like, why on? What would prompt someone to post something like that? It was a model kit. It wasn't supposed to be e anything political. It wasn't supposed to make some sort of statement. It was a freaking model kit. That's all it was. That's all. It. Nothing. Not a zip. Zip. Zilch. Nothing. Just a model kit. It's like a real life equivalent would be. Asking someone, do you want to drink? And they're like, four score and seven years ago. You're like, oh my gosh. That's the equivalent. It's, again, hit jump. Talk about jumping the rails, like train of thought, jump the track. It No, it didn't jump the track. It literally veered off course and traveled so far away from its original intended destination. I don't know where the heck it ended up. Like I said, this person is so far out there, I think they hit their head on Jupiter. Again, weird. But again, hope you guys enjoyed. That was some of the crazy, weird comments that I have received. Uh, the hateful comments that I have received. Um, I didn't do this video with the intentions of, try of hoping more people would actually post comments like that. Um, Again, I find these comments hilarious. Like, I really don't take them seriously. Um, obviously, it's a simple thing. My personal belief, you know, hey, 
If you don't like a video, you don't have to watch. Simple as that. It goes with anything. If you don't like it, don't watch. Don't read, don't look, don't listen. Um, don't do. But, you know, some people just feel that need to, that they have to do that. Um, but anyway, uh, thank you guys again for joining me. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you at least got a few good laughs out of it. Hope you got a few, a few good laughs anyway. But again, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you again for joining me and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video that I do. Take care.